Would you worship the God of Jesus? Which is whom I worship. So you're God's God. Would you worship the God of Jesus like the way Jesus worshiped his God? If you want to know the truth, Jesus says... Can you answer my question? The Bible says anyone that does not confess Jesus Christ as being born in the flesh is the spirit of the Antichrist. Well, we, we believe that he's born in the flesh. We believe he's the Messiah. We believe he's born of the Virgin. So do, wait, wait. We are already past that. Way past. Okay? Now you answer my question. Would you worship the God of Jesus? What happened? Crickets. Yes. You would? So how many gods are you worshipping now? Jesus and his God. How many gods are you worshipping? Huh? Huh? See, you can't, it's a mystery. You can't understand. It. <laughs> it's a mystery. It's not a mystery. God told us there's only one God. Your Bible says there's only one God. The Quran says there's only one God. How is it a mystery? It's a mystery. When God told you clearly, how is it a mystery, my friend? Okay, what is the mystery? That God is more than one? Let me tell you something. Or one? Let me tell you something. Yeah, go on. When Jesus came to the earth, you know who he came to? What do you mean? He came to the bunny Israel. When he came to the earth, yeah, the children of Israel. And he was born. He was born as a ver. He was born as. A, he was born in the stables. Who did he come to? Who did he come to? Who did he? Who did he come to speak to? The Israel. He came to the bunny Israel. That's right. He came to speak to yeah. the Jews. The Jews says no, crucify him. And what does that got to do with me asking you? Do you worship crucify the God of Jesus? You said you would worship Jesus and the God of Jesus. How many gods have you got now? Away oops, oops, what happened? I'm trying to say to you, what? it's a mystery. I can never explain Why is it a mystery? God told you that he's only one. It's a mystery. You'll never understand. Okay. Have you read the Bible ever? Yes. Have you read? I've read it about six or seven times. Have you read John 7 and 3? Yes, I've read all the What Bible. does it say in John 7 and 3? You quote it, you want. No, no, you said you've read it six or seven, seven times. That's fine. Do you understand the Bible? Some of it. Only some of it. You read it six or seven times and you still understand only some of it. It's a complex book, you know. Do you understand this passage? I understand. Do you understand this passage? I can never explain it to you. you, you Do you understand see. this passage? You, never see. you know, for a person who loves Jesus, he refuses to read the words of Jesus, that's very odd. Absolutely. You know? Because you can take you see, you talk you'll take that one scripture and you'll take it out of context. Why don't you put it in context? Huh? I'm giving it to you to read it. Put it in context, educate me if you want to, then you go. A person who says never by reading even the, pa as, as, as the as very as passage as that he says is of his God. As far as you're concerned, the, the Islam is right and Muhammad is right and everyone else is wrong. As far as you're concerned, the Bible is right. Am I right? Am I right? You have to think about that, seriously. You still need time? Is the Bible right? The Bible is, is the Bible from God Almighty? Yeah, sure. The Bible, as you call it, is not just the Bible, it's the words from the mouth of God. Right. And is that right? Yes, it's right. Okay. So when it says here, now this is eternal life, that they may know you, the Father, the only true God, and Jesus Christ, whom you have sent. What do you understand when Jesus says, the Father is the only true God, and Jesus Christ, whom you have sent. By the way, how many true gods do you believe in? There's one. One. And according to Jesus, who is that only true God? The Father. According to you, who is God? Answer, answer, answer. Yeah, go on. We Christians believe there's 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 one, there's three, there's Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Right. We believe the Trinity. Right. And who three taught you that? The three. Who who taught you that? Huh? Who taught you that? We studied that. It's not in the Bible. Church? So who taught you that? Church. It's a mystery. No, it's not a mystery. <laughs> it's not a mystery because Jesus tells you. It is a mystery. Jesus tells you. Huh? Why is it always the M word? You know when it's they can mystery. just get away with it. It's a mystery. By the way, do you you know you said the word the Bible is wait wait you said the Bible is the word of God. Am I right? That's right. Right. So when the Bible when Jesus says in the Bible that the only true God is the Father, which you acknowledged, right. is that a mystery? Yes. 